Good morning, students. Today we are going to learn sixth standard grammar topic adjectives. Adjective of number word which expresses the exact number of nouns or pronouns and their position or place in certain order is called adjective of number word which expresses the exact number of nouns or pronouns and their position or place in certain order is called adjective of number for example one or first two or second three or third so on each no several all some etc see the sentences a week has seven days a week has seven days there are nine persons in a group there are nine persons in a group every poor needs job every poor needs job there are no stories in this book there are no stories in this book next difference between adjective of quantity and adjective of number difference between adjective of quantity and adjective of number the difference between adjective of number and adjective or adjectives of quantity is that indefinite uh, indefinite numeral adjectives some few many etc are used with countable nouns whereas adjectives of quantity some few many etc are used with uncountable nouns difference between adjective of quantity and adjective of number the difference between adjective of number and adjectives of quantity is that indefinite numeral adjectives that is some few many etc are used with countable nouns whereas adjectives of quantity that is some few many etc are used with uncountable nouns are used with uncountable nouns For, uh, see the sentences i drank some water adjective of quantity adjective of quantity some people standing there some people standing there adjective of number difference between adjective of quantity and adjective of number the difference between adjective of number and adjective of quantity is the indefinite numeral adjectives that is some few many etc are used with countable nouns whereas adjectives of quantity some few many etc are used with uncountable noun example i drank some water adjective of quantity some people standing there adjective of number next demonstrative adjective next demonstrative adjective words that are used to point out specific person or things are called demonstrative adjective words that are used to point out specific person or things are called demonstrative adjective for example this that these those later former such etc words that are used to point out specific person or things are called the demonstrative adjective for example this that these those later former 
such etc see the sentences i hate such things the former present presentation of lecture was good the later option will cost us a lot the later option will cost us a lot i hate such things the former presentation of lecture was good the later option will cost uh, cost us a lot difference between distributive adjective and distributive pronoun difference between distributive adjective and distributive pronoun distributive adjective distributive adjective modifies a noun or pronoun distributive adjective modifies a noun or pronoun there is always a noun next to the distributive adjective each man was given a pen each man was given a pen next distributive pronoun next distributive pronoun distributive pronoun used as a subject or object there is never a noun next to the distributive pronoun example each of us will get a pen each of us will get a pen difference between distributive adjective and distributive pronoun distributive adjective distributive adjective modifies a noun or pronoun there is always a noun next to the distributive adjective for example each man was given a pen next distributive pronoun distributive pronoun used as a subject or object there is never a noun next to the distributive pronoun for example each of us will get a pen okay students i hope you are all understood thank you